Hey guys, this is Mike Sigla from TrueFury.com. So, another day, another jog. Um, not in Siberia anymore. We have spring here. It's it's the weather is changing. It's really nice today. One of the first hottest days in the year this year. And today I want to tell you about this idea. I say trust the process, and what I mean by that, you know, very often we want some kind of change in life maybe we are not happy with our job maybe with our relationships and um, what might happen is that the universe will try to bring you that change will rearrange your life for you but we tend to resist that change because we are not consciously aware that the change is coming so you know we often make choices based on uh, conditioning. We might think maybe this job will be good for us because it makes more money, but then once you start working there, you find out that you're completely drained, you know, unhappy, and it doesn't really make anything good in your life. So we often do things because we think something's gonna be better for us when in fact it might be completely the opposite. And sometimes, there is something that will be better for us, will be more aligned with our true purpose that we don't see, don't notice and don't understand. So that's the higher level of synchronicities. Some people call it aligning with your higher self. Others call it tuning into your subconscious or superconscious. So let me give you an example of that because it's. I think it's always better if you you see an example. So a couple of months ago I interviewed this guy called Dylan Werner and he's one of the most recognized yoga teachers in the world. He has like 700,000 followers on Instagram and he's extremely passionate about yoga and he loves what he's doing. He's traveling the world, he is teaching uh, yoga and 10 years ago when he was starting yoga just doing it as a hobby uh, he was working as a firefighter in California and he enjoyed his job he was he was well paid he was repaying his mortgage all this usual stuff and uh, one day they decided to fire him so at that moment his life turned upside down you know he thought this is it, you know, I have responsibilities, bills to pay. You know, I was working so hard to become a firefighter and now it's all gone. So he thought, okay, what is that I can do instead? And uh, at that time he was already getting into yoga, starting to teach yoga. So he started doing exactly that. And obviously it was hard at, at the beginning because he couldn't afford to pay the mortgage, all these kind of things. But over time he created completely different life so he he when he looks at it now 10 years later he says that was the biggest gift that the universe offered him you never know maybe he would still work as a firefighter you know there's nothing wrong about being a firefighter or anything like that but for him there was a completely different path sometimes there is already something in place that it's coming and we don't understand it because we look at things from a rational perspective and we often will resist it so let's say I don't know your business is falling apart or you're losing your job or whatever you might resist that change but sometimes there might be actually something better behind that you are not even ready to see yet I see it quite a lot you know sometimes we we force things instead of allowing them to flow and they actually the current brings us to another destination that is much better so keep that in mind and let me know what you think about some of these ideas share this video or comment and subscribe thanks